In this video, we want to demonstrate a total laparoscopic hysterectomy with bilateral adnexomy using a Maryland ligature device. We started by positioning the patient, we used the DD entry technique with an optical trocar and after to clean the optic we used the clarify system and as always we try to identify the anatomical landmarks like the, the ureters We started the laparoscopic hysterectomy by coagulating and cutting the left round ligament. The ligature Maryland tool is very efficient. Also, it allows a very precise dissection, as you can easily see in this uh, step of the procedure. After we moved to the opening of the anterior leaflet of broad ligament up to the vesico-uterine space, you can observe the dissection ability of this Maryland instrument. The vessels are quite well skeletonized the plutonium separated towards the vesico uterine bolt. After we make the fenestration of the broad ligament, in this case because we want to remove the ovaries, we make a fenestration parallel to the infundibular pelvic ligament, the assistant grasps the tubes and afterwards with the bipolar Maryland ligature we coagulate and cut the infundibular pelvic ligament or ovarian suspensory ligament. It is also relevant the opening of the posterior leaflet of broad ligament up to the cervix and ultrasacral ligament in order to isolate the uterine vascular pedicle also from a posterior approach. Then we move to the right side again coagulation and section of the right round ligament you see with this device almost there is no thermal spread and it causes the fusion of the tissues you open the broad ligament and on this side you do exactly the same that you, you we have that we have done on the left side opening the anterior leaflet of broad ligament up to vesico-uterine space parallel to the IP ligament, now population and cutting of the right infundial of pelvic. Then we open the vesicle vaginal space.
ovulation and section of the uterine pedicles. As you can see very clearly, you ovulate and cut the uterine artery. Ovulation and cut of the uterine artery. Now we open the vagina with a monopolar book. You can see clearly the cervix. We are using a Clermont Ferrand uterine manipulator again we came out with the, the scope and we used the clarify to clean the picture after the vagina totally open we remove the specimen through the vagina and using a intracorporeal suture we closed the vagina.